And just a short look around the aquaponics greenhouse today. Um, we've got some uh, really good watercress. This tomato is looking fabulous, absolutely marvelous. We've got uh, we've bl got blooms, beautiful foliage on this. This is uh, grown in the uh, one of the Dutch buckets using uh, perlite as the growing medium. And uh, here we have just about the healthiest cabbage I believe I've ever seen. Um, same thing, growing in one of the Dutch buckets in perlite. And um, here we have an abundance of watercress. Uh, Superfood, it's uh, good stuff. And the fish love it. And uh, here's our fish tank. It's a 55 gallon drum uh, made out of plastic. Let's see if we can get them to come up and eat anything. You guys hungry? Oh, yeah, there they are. These tilapia were three quarters of an inch long when I first put them in here. And uh, they are about uh, eight inches long now and uh, just as healthy as they can be. Let's see, this heater says that, uh, well, let's see, about 79 degrees on one side. And about 80 degrees on the other side. So, we've got a couple of uh, bubblers here, giving us a little extra aeration to the uh, fish tank. And uh, on this, this is kind of my junk side of the of the greenhouse here. Got to uh, keep my fish food over here and. This will be changed into something, maybe nutrient film technique or vertical uh, nutrient film later on, but I'm not worried about that right now. And here's my little pineapple I've had for some time. So uh, I'm going to have to force a bloom on this thing, get, get some pineapple off of it. It's, it's grown huge, absolutely huge. You notice all the bubble wrap? This is uh, my extra insulation for the greenhouse and it's working out absolutely great. Just absolutely great. Okay, that's the update for today.